we will be talking about family lily liliaceae liliaceae family so in liliaceae family as you know okay, this family it is representative representative of monocots representative of which one monocots so in this if you notice okay, in liliaceae family it is representative of monocots so except fabaceae all the other families they have got what type of flowers with actinomorphic symmetry that means in this radius also as well as in this radius also we can cut the flower into two equal halves and what type of flowers are there in all families there are bisexual flowers are there then in liliaceae there is a presence of perianth what perianth is okay perianth there is no segregation of sepals and petals so these unit unit of perianth is called as sepal so this is perianth then androecium there is 3 plus 3 and in no family except fabaceae where it is diadelphus these are not joined so perianth androecium and there is gynoecium so this one is superior ovary and then these syncarpus tricarpillary condition is there so if you notice here then you see okay what is the digit associated with liliaceae 333 three, three. so you read it like this okay, this is one this is one and this is one so one plus one plus one three so that's why in liliaceae family there will be three 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 and three so in no family fabaceae diadelphus except that no family stamens are fused whereas in case of this in given uh, we are talking about ncld families and here these are syncarpus okay, in all three four families these carpels are fused syncarpus condition is there so this is the family formula of liliaceae similarly if you see so this is the family formula of liliaceae then what are the examples of this how can you remember examples of this so we can remember this from a mnemonic okay, let's say there is a dawn is there dawn what there is a dawn lily dawn lily is there lily dawn is there and if she is dawn then she would do things as per her, her wish so if dawn lily is there and she would do things as per her wish so what is as per her wish asparagus what is another example asparagus and if she is dawn then no one would stay with her so what will be that the next example she would stay alone that means aloe vera so dawn lily is there and if she is dawn then she would do things as per her wish and she would stay alone and she has got cold she has got cold so what is that colchicin is another example she has got cold colchicin so that is why she had got cold because she ate onion what she ate onion so she got cold so she would do things as per her wish and she is dawn so she stays alone and she got cold because she is eating what onion and what is that if she is dawn then what will be there if she is dawn then there will be glories her glories will be there so gloriosa is another example glories will be there and if she is dawn so how many lips she is having two lips so that means tulip so tulip asparagus aloe vera colchicin onion and gloriosa these are the example of family liliaceae so based on this you can they can ask a number of questions so like if they the question could be framed in aloe vera what type of condition is there perianth and another characteristic of this okay this stamens they are attached with the perianth so this condition is called as epitapellus or epiphyllus epitapellus or which one epiphyllus thank you all thank you very much be wise and revise